Flexural Strength Test on Concrete The flexural strength of concrete is an indirect method for measuring the tensile strength of concrete. The test is made on the beam of size 150 mm into 150 mm into 700 mm or 100 mm into 100 mm into 500 mm. Flexural strength of concrete is determined by either central point loading or two point loading. The typical machine used for this test is shown on the screen. The bed of the testing machine is be provided with two steel rollers of 38 mm in diameter. The rollers is mounted at the distance from center to center is 600 mm for 150 mm specimens and 400 mm for 100 mm specimens. The load applied through similar roller mounted at the top. In case of two-point loading the rollers are spaced at 200 cm or 133 cm center to center. The concrete is prepared as per required grade of concrete and placed on the mold in layers and tamped 25 blows for each layer. After a day, the mold is removed and the specimen is placed in the curing tank at a temperature of 27 plus or minus 2 degrees Celsius. Depending upon the requirement, the test specimen is removed from tank and dried at 14 and 28 days for testing. The specimen is placed on the rollers and centered with the longitudinal axis of the specimen the load is applied at a rate of loading of 400 kg per minute for the 150 mm specimens and at a rate of 180 kg per minute for the 100 mm specimens. Finally, note down the load at which cylinder fails by developing cracks. Now, Measure the distance between the line of fracture and the nearest support. Consider this as A. If A is greater than 200 mm for 150 mm and 130 mm for 100 mm specimen, then flexural strength or modulus of rupture, Fb, is calculated by equation. Fb is equal to P into L divided by Vd square. If A is less than 200 mm and greater than 170 mm for 150 mm and less than 133 mm and greater than 110 mm for 100 mm specimen, then flexural strength or modulus of rupture Fb is calculated by equation. Fb is equal to 3pa divided by bd square. Where b is the width of the beam in millimeters. D is the failure point depth in millimeters. L is the supported length in millimeters. P is the maximum load applied to the beam in kilograms. And A is the distance between the line of fracture and nearest support in millimeter. Thank you for watching. لا تنسوا الإعجاب بالفيديو والاشتراك في القناة تشجيعا لنا لنستمر بنشر المزيد إن شاء الله.